Hello everybody and welcome to a special Saturday episode of 2K Rebirth. And as we see coming down to the ring right now, the retaining, the still your undisputed champion ship holder, the Velveteen Dream. Or excuse me, the Velveteen King. Because he has proven, interferences or not, he can defend the title whenever and wherever he wants to and come out successful. But tonight, we'll be seeing what the Dream has to say for his future and just see who's the next challenger for him. And then also tonight, We'll be having a very special guest announce the upcoming matches for this Sunday's pay-per-view payback. I know a week after SummerSlam, I decided to give the Dream a week off to, or a pay-per-view off, and just, you know, relax and redeem himself. So, who will be competing in the number one contender matches this Sunday? We will be seeing later tonight. But we'll also be seeing who's gunning for the dream in just a moment. But until then, let's hear the dream's words and what he has to say about his successful title reign so far. He said, I can defend this title against anybody, especially that stupid timekeeper, Carrion Cross. But I think Cross has a different mindset because here he is, Carrion Cross making his way down to the ring. Will he have to say anything about this? Or will he just stare Dream into leaving his ring and then go on to successfully defeat Jeff Hardy? We will be seeing. But until then, let's just take take in this this atmosphere, take in this moment, and see what Cross's next action will be. Oh, 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 the Velveteen Dream is backing off and going to the back. And with that being done, I think we can get into the first match of the night, which is going to be Karrion Cross taking on the charismatic enigma, Jeff Hardy. Velveteen Dream shook and in fear. Will he be able to successfully defend his title if Cross ever gets the chance? Who knows? But all I know is... Cross is going to have some fun dealing with Hardy. So let's get into the match and find out who will win. Hardy now making his way down to the ring. The dream just left. He didn't even want to deal with carrying Cross. He just... He just left through the through the through the crowd. But this will be an impressive an impressive matchup here tonight. The charismatic enigma willing to do anything. Jeff Hardy. Will he be willing to do everything here tonight to win? Or will Cross be willing to break everything and destroy everything Hardy has to offer against him here tonight? There we go, Carrion Cross, Jeff 
Hardy. Here we go. Carrying Cross. Recent debut in the series. Running knee. No one there. Oh my god. Running knee right to the face of Hardy. Carrying Cross just sending messages. Uh, you know, here and there about championship reigns and time running out. And he was right about everybody. Besides the Velveteen Dream. Velveteen Dream was successful in retaining his championship this past Sunday at SummerSlam. But I honestly think Karrion Cross knows that Dream cannot defend his title successfully against him. Ooh, shot to the face. Jeff Hardy getting a DDT to put Cross down. Oh, oh, shot to the face, Cross. Oh, big boot to the face of Hardy. And if that is so, then Cross has got Velveteen in the palm of his hand. Oh, turn it around. Whoa, whoa, turnover from Cross. Cross going to the outside. Oh, telling Hardy he shouldn't have done that. Oh, shit, roll through. Oh, just again in front of Hardy. Oh, gets out of the way. Oh, switches out. Oh, exploder. No, elbow to the back of the neck. Oh, clothesline over the ropes. Hardy. Oh, keeping strong with Cross. We saw, saw the kind of momentum like this from Mandrews, but in the end, he did not successfully defeat, defeat, defeat Karrion Cross. Hardy, on the other hand, keeping a quicker pace. Taunting, which isn't a smart thing to do. Being smug. Is something you don't want to do against Karrion Cross thrown into the steps and that's exactly why he can take advantage whenever he wants to Six. oh shit Karrion Cross oh no oh, oh, oh my god powerbomb on the barricade good thing those aren't metal oh my god exploder suplex into the edge of the bottom step Oh, shit. Going for an airplane spin. Airplane crash. God damn. Twirly bird gets the worm. Oh, big boot. Carrying cross waking up Hardy. Oh, clothesline force field applied from Hardy. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, oh. no. He faked him out. <laughs> Bored. Or, uh, board, uh, face meeting. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> face meeting the basketball floor. <laughs> Cutter onto the basketball floor as well. Oh my god! Gary and Cross plank slam to the outside. Oh shit, Karen Cross going for a signature, but no, Hardy gets out of the way. Crucifix rolls him over on his neck. Oh, Hardy. Being, being too, being too cocky. Taunting above, cross, oh, blocked by cross. Oh, exploder, suplex on the floor. God damn it, cross does not give two shits about the well-being of Hardy. Oh no, oh no. Oh, oh, oh back suplex on the barricade head off the barricade oh running knee no one there oh coming in the ring going in for a runner oh shit oh tried to grapple with him but no oh ducked under oh shit carrying cross has him in his hands oh back suplex on the apron looking him up Oh, Karrion Cross, what the hell is this? Oh, ho, ho. Venus, fly drop. Oh, two. And the fisherman to finish it off. Oh, Karrion Cross, awakening Hari. Oh shit. Oh, oh, oh. One, two, three. Carrion Cross reigns supreme.
and sends a message to the Velveteen Dream. Holy shit. Holy shit. I'm scared for the Velveteen Dream. I mean, Cross is eyeing that title, but just the thought of Cross becoming number one contender and defeating the Velveteen Dream scares the shit out of me. I'm I'm all for hopes Dream can successfully retain, but I don't know about Cross. I think Cross just wants to hurt people. So with that said, let's get into the special guest and the you know, the matches that are being made or going to be made for payback right now. Some big matches announced for Payback. I mean, we heard some. We heard them all. We heard, first of all, this is a big one. Tommaso Ciampa versus Johnny Gargano. Winner makes the other person leave WWE. Then we got Sasha Banks versus Bayley for the Undisputed Women's championship number one contendership and then we're gonna be seeing the revival take on the young bucks for the t undisputed tag team championship uh number one contender match and we're gonna be seeing pete dunn versus john moxley for the united states championship number one contender match and he said it'll be alistair black taking on whoever the dream will be seeing here tonight so who will that person be? We will be seeing. But the dream looks happy as all to be here tonight. Oh my god. It is carrying cross. Oh, oh, oh shit. Oh, oh, oh my god. <laughs> Trying to slap that that crown off the dream's head. Oh shit, carrying. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh. Pendulum Death Driver On the basketball floor running knee Cross getting out. Oh my god he's getting out of the table Oh oh Dream catches it Dream catches the table from Cross but Cross re re uh, re, um, uh, saves himself. Oh, oh my god, just switching off. Dream doing it out of frustration and worry that Cross will get the upper hand, but Cross just doing it out of dominance. Cross going up. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, force field. Oh shit, Dream. Dream taunting. Dream taunting when I think he shouldn't. Maybe Cross did that to trip up Dream. Maybe Dream thinks he has the advantage. But no. Oh, no, he doesn't. Oh, shit. Dragon screw. Oh, what a smart maneuver by Cross. Cross now getting another table. God. Cross wants to risk it all to prove it all to Dream. Oh, God. Oh, cross, cross, cross. Oh, what a shot to the face. Oh, shit, where's Cross going with Dream? Dream being sent outside. Oh, my God. Cross. Oh, no. No. Power bomb through the table. Oh, oh elbow. No one there. Dream just gets right back up, showcasing his resiliency. Of throwing him in the ring. 
Oh my god, getting another table. God damn, Cross just loves his tables. He's also getting a chair. Um, whoa, what the hell kind of chair is that? I don't know. It's some kind of chair. Oh shit, Dream. Ah, oh, knee to the midsection. Axe out to the back. Takes Cross down. But will he put Cross away? Oh, got wrench on the chair leg. But Cross. Oh, oh shit. Oh. Oh. Trips up Dream. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh shit, butterfly suplex! On the chair! Oh shit, oh my god. Death driver! Again! Oh my god. Cross has no gift. Oh no, not on the table leg. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh, my god. If this is who Alistair Black is facing, I'm more worried for Alistair Black than I am Karrion Cross. Holy shit. What a mat, what a night of matches payback has for us. John Moxley versus P. Tun. Sasha Banks versus Bailey. The Revival versus the Young Bucks, Tommaso Ciampa versus Johnny Gargano, and Karrion Cross versus Aleister Black. Will Cross be successful? Oh my god, he is not done. I have a feeling he will be. Throwing him in. Turning him over now. Come on, Cross. Cross putting the Dream's head right in there. Right in the chair. Going to snap it in two. Cross. Oh, ho, oh, oh, Plank slam. Over. Velveteen Dream's head. Oh, my God. Cross. Oh, Dream. Dumbfounded. Punt to the head. Punts him almost out of the ring. And now, Cross sends a message. Just right there and then. Oh my god, oh my god, no! Oh, oh my god, he won't stop beating the corpse of Velvety Dream. Oh my god, get the, oh, get the shit off TV. This is unbearable. Cross clearly sends a message. I believe he'll win against Alistair Black. But who knows what Alistair Black has his has in his pocket. But with that said, this has been Rebirth. Cross stands tall and sends a message to not only Dream, but everybody else in his way. Be sure to check out Payback, and I'll see y'all in the next one.